Hello. Um, you will see that I'm not 17, actually. I'm a little bit older. Um, but I'm really happy to be here with you in Brussels. It's, um, it's a pleasure. Tomorrow, it will be one month uh, till the terrorist attacks in Brussels. So I, think, I really think we have to be proud of Brussels. We have a lot of assets here in Brussels, and among them, touristic assets. For example, we have the the beautiful, uh, the most beautiful place in the world, Grand Place. And um, I really would like that all tourists coming to Brussels in, in the next weeks or next months would share this kind of picture uh, to their friends and families. But uh, actually, they, they will not do it because the kind of picture they will take at Grand Place, it's more, it's more uh, such kind of pictures, selfies. And... Um, Actually, I, I cannot blame them for from doing that because when I'm with my, my kids at Eiffel Tower or, or Versailles, I also try to make a, a selfie with my kids and a small piece of the, the, the Eiffel Tower in, in, in the picture. But it's, it's difficult and it's frustrating. And uh, I guess for the director of the Brussels Tourism Office, it's also frustrating that to see that this is the kind of pictures shared uh, from Grand Place. In fact... I would like to address this kind of problem, have the panorama and me. So there is a scale problem. Uh, if I take the, the wall scenery, I will be very small in the picture. Uh, and if I, there is my big face, you, you don't see much of the Grand Place. So the only way, the only way to, to, to do it, I think, is to do this. But how can we do this? How can we add um, a dimension, an extra dimension to a, to a selfie? In fact, make a, s a panoramic selfie. Uh, it's very, very easy. You, you go to the Grand Place. You stand at a certain point. You use your smartphone with an application. You make a selfie of you. And at the same time, there is another camera, 100, 200, or 300 meters away from you, that is triggered at the same time, and that will take some uh, pictures. We merge the selfie and the pictures in a video, and you get this. In the, in the near future, you will have uh, the opportunity to uh, choose the duration of your video, whether you want to post it on Instagram or on other social networks, the transition effect between the selfie and the pictures, the tag at the end, and a magic touch. You will be able to erase all the tourists uh, around you so that you are alone at Grand Place. Um, we want to propose this product to um, sport and music events, uh, huge events, the kind of events you, you really want to, to, uh, to tell your friends you are here, for Tomorrowland, for example, and so huge that in a picture you cannot show how, how big it is. Uh, of course, cities, monuments, regions, uh, museums, um, theme parks, holiday resorts, and uh, cruise companies. Our business model is not uh, already uh, uh, fixed. We can rent equipment and the use of the app. We can also uh, sell it to sponsor or as uh, media, uh, media space. And we uh, also have to test if the end user is ready to pay for a contribution. Uh, but on, only a real testing will, will give answers to that. Right now, we are busy with our MVP. We want to be ready for summer because com commercially it's very important for, 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 for us. Uh, so we are uh, busy uh, with our team. So if you want to join us, uh, we can talk after that. We, we are searching for early adopter clients. We will play the game with us uh, and give us uh, uh, feedback. And uh, we also search for some funding because we, are, uh, uh, we want to start uh, it properly. So if you have any questions, you can come, uh, uh, you can tell me now. Okay, thank you, Rafael. <laughs>